What's going on, everybody? Z here, and welcome to Core Keeper. Now, this game caught my interest because it looks like I'm going to compare it right now, and it it's the comparison. It looks like Stardew Valley kind of meets Oxygen Not Included in the way that you're. It looks like you're underground and you're in caves and you're building out a layer and you're building out defenses. And there's like enemies. There's exploring. There's farming. There's things. It looks cool. It looks interesting. So we're going to hop on in today. Um, if you're interested, there will be a link down below to the free demo version. I believe it's coming out on March. 8th if i'm not mistaken i don't know if that's early access or the game it is multiplayer um up to eight people i think so uh yeah we're gonna go ahead we're gonna start a new game now again this is only a demo so i don't know how much we're gonna be able to do we're just gonna name it the underlands why not and done okay so character slot oh character type standard hardcore oh no let's just do standard um oh look you can customize your character okay hold on Okay, so I made my character, but then you also have a background here. So, Chef Gardener, no bad. An ordinary person without uh, without starting equipment, but all the possibilities. Starting perks, none. Explorer, so you get plus three running skill, one small lantern, plus three food rations. A miner, you get three mining skills, one copper pickaxe, three food rations. A veteran miner, knowledgeable about breaking down walls effectively. A fighter, so you get some melee and food. Cooking gardening oh this is super cool so i'm gonna go with um i'm actually gonna go with miner because i feel like there's a little, quite a bit of mining to do here and i'm just gonna name myself z1g because that's just you know whatever it is what it is okay let's do it oh i'm so excited and of course if you guys enjoy the video please make sure you leave a like on the video it helps out a lot and subscribe and maybe comment down below let me know what you think let me know what type of games you think that this kind of is once you see a little bit of gameplay here uh, let me know what you think, because I'm thinking Stardew Valley and a little bit of, uh, like, Auction Not Included. Maybe RimWorld? I don't know. Maybe RimWorld's a better kind of comparison. I have no idea. Uh, but there's some story here. I just want to... I want... I'm ready. Uh, let's do this! Oh. I think that's our core. Oh. We've arrived. It's really dark. Okay, so we've got this. We've got food rations. Uh, e. It looks like it needs energy. Maybe I need to pop off the vines. Oh, gosh. I can't see anything. Uh, what do we got in here? Oh, torch. Okay. Crafting torch. Basic workbench. So, was that stuff? Th oh, I gathered wood. Okay, so let's craft some torches. Maybe another set of torches. Okay. So let's place one there. Let's kind of get one on, like on all the sides here. Oh, so I mean, you start off with like a little, a decent amount of like resources, like wood wise. Oh, oh wait, I need to not be using a torch to do. <laughs> I was using a torch to break all the sticks off of here. Okay, and then let's see, let's place another one right here. Okay, let's clean up this area a little bit. We got some delicious mushrooms. All right, I'm going to craft up another set of torches here, and I'm going to set one down right here and one over here because it's a little bit dark over here. Okay, so now it looks like it needs power. Are these things like power generators? What are these? Uh, Gorm the Devourer Crystal Slot. Glurch the Abdominus Mass. Oh, you know what? These are bosses. So, like, it looks like maybe when we defeat a boss, we get the crystal for it, and then maybe it powers it up. It seems powered. It looks like it needs energy. It seems powered down. Okay, and then is this like another uh, unlocked in early access? Okay, so that's not unlocked yet. So it looks like we need to start doing some mining here. Now, I notice on this side, there's some sparklies over here. So let's go ahead and let's get mining, I guess. See what we got. We're gonna go and place that torch down so we can continue seeing. Okay, there's definitely something over here because there's something right there too. I, you know what? I need a lot of torches. Uh, turf wall. Let's go ahead and just throw some of these to the side here. Root seed, dirt wall. Wood. We could make a, a workbench as well, but I kind of want to see what's going on here. So that looks like some kind of ore. 
Yeah, that was definitely some kind of ore. What is that? Copper ore? Okay, that's kind of neat. Um, oh, there's like a there's like a cave entrance right here. Okay, so if I pop this over here. Oh, snap. Oh, we're exploring a cave. Oh, and there's a nice little mini map up here. Okay, that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and just set some lights down every now and then. I mean, if him, if Mike, oh, there's water. <gasps> there's like a little seed thing over there. Okay. That's all cool. Uh, you know what? Actually, let's go ahead and let's dig back this way. So now we can go this way if we need to. Okay, so we have a little bit of area to do some stuff here. Um, I want to see what... Let's go ahead and break this stuff down. Let me just set a torch down right there. I want to see what that little glowing seed thing is. Alright, what is this? New item, glow tulip and a glow tulip seed. Okay. I don't know if we can swim. I'm not sure that swimming is in our uh, our ability set here. I mean, maybe, maybe we can do some fishing or something. I have no idea. Okay, you know what? Let's get a uh, let's get a craft bench built. A basic crafting bench, and then let's go ahead and get this set up. Um, uh, you know what? This area right here is kind of cleared out. Well, you know what? I think we should probably do everything over here. Let's just set it right here, maybe. Okay, so now what do I do with it? Um, okay, so we got tools, crafting. We got furnace. Uh, standard furnace melts basic metal ores. Okay, so we have copper. And then copper bars and woods. Okay, so that's how we get copper tools. We have a copper pickaxe already. Base, wood wall, solid wood wall. Works well for building a base, wooden floors, chest. So that can be, okay, so let's go ahead and let's get the furnace. Uh, we'll just set it right there. And we'll grab this guy, we'll throw this into here. Oh, and it just does its thing. It doesn't even need like a, uh, okay, cool. It doesn't need anything. And then let's also get a chest so we can store our valuables. Um, we'll set that right here. And then we can store stuff in there, okay. So that's super neat. So there's one copper bar. There's two copper bars. So now we could go into here and then we can go ahead and make uh, more stuff as needed. But we're going to need more. Um, I'm going to wait for now. Can we shift click into the inventory? Oh, yes, we can. Okay, I'm going to wait and we're going to just throw some stuff in there for now. And let's do some more explorational type stuff. So we need to figure out. We need more. Um, Need more ore. It looks like there might be some more ore this way. Oh, did we just open up a... Oh, see, this is super cool. Now, can I place... I wonder if I can place, like... Okay, so what is this? A wooden wall? Can I place that in the water to make, like, a step? No, it doesn't really look like it. Okay. Let's break through here. Oh, that's not ore. All right, let's keep exploring a little bit here. I don't think we can't go in the water. So that definitely looks like fishing, possibly. Was there any kind of fishing poles or anything? Oh, food and health. Oh, we need to start figuring out our food situation. I bet you the mushrooms are food. Oh, we got some more stuff over here too. Okay. So let's see here. Did we, did we, I don't think there was a fishing pole immediately. Um, cooking pot, cook ingredients, bring out their full potential, combine two and see what happens. Um, an anvil, a tin workbench. So we definitely need more copper and we need more torches. Let's go ahead and get some torches in here. Okay. We're going to, let's mine this way and see if we can't see if maybe there's some copper over here. Okay, so I see these walls. I'm thinking that these walls mean that there's going to be a cave nearby. Oh, kind of. Uh, there's more stuff over here.
Oh. My screen just shook. Like there was a big nasty or something over here. Uh, yeah, there's something going on. There's something somewhere. My screen was shaking. Oh, there. See? Okay, well, let's go see. We must investigate. I don't really have any way to defeat anything right now. But I'm curious. Okay, so we got another water spot here. I don't know if this is going to be water or what. Oh, there's something over here. Okay, so we just found another cave thing right here. Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, there's something big going on here. A bomb pepper seed? And then we've got another glow tulip. All right, so there's some more copper. There's definitely something over here. I don't know if it's like breaking walls down trying to get to me. I have zero idea. But I know we have copper. Uh, so let's go ahead and let's throw our copper in there. That'll give us 12 bars. Now, that would be enough to make a copper anvil. We'll get started with creating armor for looks and combat. Or a cooking pot. Bomb pepper seed, glow tulip seed, plus four glow for one minute, plus food can be cooked. Oh, so it almost looks like we need to start gardening. Um, Was there a, was there like a shovel? Good for digging up ground. And a watering can used to water seeds and soil. So might be a good idea to have a garden. And it might actually be have a good idea to have a garden next to a water source. And there's a water source literally right here as well. It's like we could throw a little garden area in here maybe? Maybe? Mm, maybe? Oh wow, those rations do not add a lot of food. Holy moly. Uh, yeah, we're gonna need to get food going like ASAP. And we need a cooking pot. Okay, so the anvil's gonna have to wait. Okay, so we've got 12 copper bars. Let's go ahead and throw everything in our inventory real quick. And then let's go into here. We need probably a watering can, a shovel, and a cook pot. Watering can, shovel, and a cooking pot. Those are probably the things that we need. Oh, a wood bridge. Okay, so there's how we get, um, that's how we get other stuff. Okay, so let's go over here and let's make a, uh, let's make a little garden area. Oh, we got some, like, sand or something. This is, like, sand or something right here. Oh, you know what I just realized? Oh, shoot. Do I have enough copper for, uh... Okay, I do have enough copper for another pickaxe. Ooh, actually, can we just repair ours? I don't know if that's gonna be a thing. I don't see, uh... We might be able to do that at the anvil, but, um... We're gonna go ahead and make another pickaxe right now. Just in case. I don't want to run out of mine. And pickaxe broke. See? Glad I made another one. Okay. So let's get a shovel in here. We've got two gl glow tulip seeds. We've got a bomb pepper seed. A root seed. Once planted, it spreads roots in every direction. So I think that's how we get wood. So let's not... Oh, I can't go in there now. Huh. I just made a hole. Can I plant these somewhere? Hmm, how do we make, how do we plant stuff? So, we definitely need some kind of soil. Oh, see now that just made another hole. And then that just makes a wall. Hmm, what is this? Sand wall. Dirt wall, turf wall. How do we, I feel like we need to make like, maybe, maybe the watering can? I wonder if the watering can, that won't work. I was curious if maybe the watering can would like make soil. I don't know. I'm not really sure how to do this right now. So I'm just going to go ahead and throw everything into storage for now. Oh, we need to set out our, um, our cooking cauldron thing too. Let's go ahead and get that out. Now, if we cook up 
So bomb pepper is oh geez. Minus eleven health. So what if we do like a glow tulip and a mushroom? Are we gonna get a glowing mushroom stew? <laughs> That's what we need. So mushy tulip salad. 19 oh 19 food. Nine food and one food. Oh, so this is so much better. Plus four health every second for 20 seconds. Holy moly. That is awesome. That's like a regen kind of food. Okay, that's cool. All right, let's keep exploring here because I'm not actually sure what. Maybe I need to make the anvil in order to make a... Maybe there's like... No, because that says armor. Oh my gosh. There's a, there's a copper hoe. Why am why did I make the shovel? I'm a dummy. I'm a dummy, and I'm sure everybody was like, what are you doing? Yep, you're right. You're right, you got me. All right, we need more copper though. There's definitely something going on over here. Let's make our way towards it. <laughs> Most people would run the other way. I run towards it. Oh, snap. Uh, we got some enemies. Holy moly. Those guys do a lot of damage. Oh my gosh, those guys do a lot of damage. Oh. I feel like I know where they came from. All right, we need to get this stuff though. We need to get some, uh, I think I need to get a sword. Something going on down here too. Can I harvest these? Okay, we're getting something out of this. Oh, oh, he's up there. Okay, so this is probably where that first big guy is going to be. Yeah, let's not get in here too far. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and put this wall up real quick. Just, just so that way they don't make their way over here. Okay, how much uh, copper do we get? We got four. Okay, so that'll be enough for a hoe. And then maybe a sword. You know, I hate how I dug these holes here. I wish I could put fill them back in. Okay, so we've got those. Um, I need to grab some wood. We still have wood in our inventory? Yes, okay. We also need to plant the wood. Okay, so there's our copper hoe. And then... Oh, the sword requires six. Okay, so let's just keep the other two out for now. Uh, let's grab the seeds. So, bomb pepper seed, glow tulip seed. A heart berry seed grows into a healthy fruit when planted. Okay. And then root seed. Okay, so the root needs us to go somewhere else. But let's go, let's grab this guy and turn all of this stuff into a farmable area. Okay, so glow tulip seeds for sure. Heartberry seed. And I guess the bomb pepper seed. All right, so there's those, and then we can water these. Oh, nice. Look at that. We did some watering stuff. Oh, that is exciting. Okay, so we've got some we got some stuff growing here. Now, we do need to get a, a wood area going. So I think actually, you know what, for the wood, let's just go over here. Let's just go into these caves. Just like right here. We'll throw one there and then we'll throw, um, start another one there. We'll see what happens. Okay, so root seed. Plant those. Watered, okay. So those we kind of want to grow out and to go wherever we want because we need the roots, we need the wood. Okay, um, so we're gonna need some food, turf wall, dirt. Okay, we, we need more. Um, we need more copper. Should we start just mining this way? Let's just mine this way and see what we can find. Okay, so I mine down here. Uh, we're getting pretty far away. There is some slime stuff over here. There are some more glow tulips and mushrooms though. Um, I'd like to grab those. I don't know how mushrooms grow. Like, I don't know in the game how mushrooms grow. Okay, all right. In the game, I don't know how those grow. So we need to try to figure those out. Oh, look at these things. So, because they're checkerboarded, I'm guessing that they're still watered? How's the wood root stuff going? Oh, it's going. It's going good. 
Okay. Oh, I'd like to get over there and get some of those glow tulips. Uh, food is already going to be an issue. Like, I can already tell you that right now. So, let's go ahead and get this stuff smelted. And then turf wall, copper bar. Gonna need another pickaxe here soon. But yeah, we need to get some more stuff going because we got to get food. Food is... Uh, yeah, food is definitely a thing. I'm going to go ahead and clear this little section out. Even though I don't really have enough uh, stuff to plant this whole area. I want to get a nice little farm going in here. You know what? Let's go over here and let's try to grab these glow tulips. I think we need to grab whatever food we can find. Oh, pickaxe broke. Wonderful. So I have, um, I'm like starving. I have no more food. Bomb pepper, plus five food, minus 11 health. So we need to mix that with, let's mix that with a mushroom. Slime and orange blob of slime can be further processed. Let's see what we get out of this. Maybe, maybe we'll get a spicy mush, a spicy mushroom that'll give us something. Uh, mushy pepper wrap. 19 food, 25.6 movement speed for one minute, plus four health recovery every second for 20 seconds. Wow. This is some good foods. Okay. Um, you know what? Before we do that, hold on. Let's go in here. Let's make another pickaxe. Uh, do we have enough for a sword? Yes. Let's go ahead and make the sword. And let's go ahead and craft up a couple more torches. Let's eat this thing, and then let's go fight that stuff. Since we got that movement speed, it might be helpful. Okay, looking good. Oh my gosh. There's a gigantic slime over here. I don't think we can fight that. Oh, he's after me. Oh, he's after me. I made a mistake. Oh, I made a mistake. I died. <laughs> Oh no, don't go after the slime, dude. Okay, so I'm guessing I lost what was in my inventory if I had anything. Oh man. Okay, that guy's hard to kill. So maybe we don't touch that guy for now. I don't think we're prepared for it. Because like, it was what, two hits and I think I was done for it. So yeah, not not great, not great. Um, You know what? We have these heartberry seeds. I don't know where I got those. Where did I get those? And a bomb pepper seed. Let's get those planted. And we got another bomb pepper seed. Let's get that planted. Let's get that watered. Okay, so that looks good. No more seeds anywhere else. Nope. <sighs> okay. So that is definitely this guy. So I'm going to guess that it drops this crystal slot, and then it probably does something. I don't know what. So we've got stat points here, too. So mining... Uh, efficient excavation, zero, five, next rank, plus 2% mining. So we have two mining points. So it looks like we have to put those points into there, but then there's like a tree. That's kind of cool. Um, and then we have gardening, vitality, crafting. Oh, there is a fishing. We'll be available in early access. Okay. Cooking, range combat, melee combat. Yeah, see. Oh. Uh, plus 5% less food drained when running. Wait, so what did we do here? Plus 4% mining damage. Oh, nice. And now we have 10% less food drained. Okay, so these stats will definitely help you stay alive. That's pretty cool. So I want to go... I really want to go see if I can grab my stuff. Because I know there was stuff in... Maybe my tomb? Maybe that tomb will have my stuff in it? But it's right next to him. If we could run faster... Does he break walls down? Okay, I got, I got this. Now that the worst is over, use it to decorate. Oh. Yeah, look at that. One hit, I'm halfway dead. 
Okay. That is... <laughs> it's not going to work for us. No, 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 no. Not ready for that yet. So I did lose... Uh, I did lose my inventory. So you keep what's on your hotbar, but you lose your inventory. I guess we'll go ahead and decorate. Uh, we'll decorate it next to this guy. Since he's the one that stole it from me. <laughs> We keep it's like, oh, I died to that. Wonderful. Oh, look at some of our stuff is done. Now, did I get any seeds? Okay, so I got, yep. Those seeds. Did I get any other seeds? Bomb pepper seeds? Heck yes. Oh, are you done? Oh, nice. Okay, let's go ahead and water these all back up. Oh, this is exciting. I don't know what it is about this that is so much fun, but it is. I wonder if more light would make these things grow faster. I don't know. We'll just set them there and see what happens. Okay, so now we have a little bit more food to play with. So we've got four mushrooms. Let's go ahead and throw two bomb peppers. That'll make two of those burritos. And then we'll... Do these have like a... Um, a like a life expectancy or like a... Um, do they spoil over time? I'm hoping that they don't. Oh, should we try a heart berry and see what we get out of a heart berry? Because by, by itself, it's nine food and two and a half health every second for 20 seconds. So let's go ahead and make that. I kind of want to see like what the different things do here. So this will give us a good option because we'll try the heart berry with mushroom, uh, that with mushroom, and then this with mushroom. We already know what that does. And this. 19 food, 25 max health for five minutes. Ooh, that's nice. But we need more mushrooms. I don't know if there's a good way to get mushrooms. And then I'm going to also guess that once we have more, so like if we mix two tulips or two, like a tulip and like a, one of these, maybe we'll get even more food off of it. I don't know. Oh, let's go see how our, our cave roots are doing. See, I don't think they're ready because I think they're going to grow out in each direction. Oh, are these mushrooms? Get out of here. Are these all mushrooms? Oh, wonderful. Now we can't plant the mushrooms, but that's okay. Let's see what else we got in here. Oh, a little bit of co little bit of copper in here. Anything else over here? Oh yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Looks like almost, it almost kind of looks like as, far, as you get further away, you get more and more uh, resources maybe. Yeah, there's a bunch of little resources here, resources here. Oh, hello. Oh, okay, we got that guy. Aha! Ancient gemstone, what? Strange blue gemstone emitting waves of energy. Ooh. Ooh, exciting. Okay, so we have more plants that we can plant too. I think we should go get those planted. And we have some copper that we can go ahead and smelt down too. So we'll start with the copper. Ooh, 16. Very nice. And then we got more seeds. And we got four, four more mushrooms in total. Okay. Let's go check on our wood. How's the wood going? Is it started expanding out yet? Oh, it has! Wonderful. So I'm going to guess that we can probably harvest... As long as we don't harvest the main thing, it'll keep growing. Oh, that's super cool. I like that. All right, let's see if we can make the anvil now. Yeah, let's get and make that, and let's see what this kind of gives us as far as options. Wood helmet... Wood chest, wood pants, copper pants, copper breastplate, and copper helmet. So we have a hundred health total, and this gives us eight health, four armor, ten health, seven armor, and nine health, six armor. That's a lot of copper right there, but that's not terrible. Oh, you know what? This wood stuff, though. We don't have that much wood either, though. Let's go ahead and put this away. I want to make sure that if I die, I don't lose everything. <laughs> put those away. Uh, let's see, we've got a glow tulip. Let's go ahead and throw it with a mushroom right now. Oh, look at all of our plants. 
They're all so happy. They almost look like they have little faces on them. Um. Okay, so we're not getting we're not getting everything back, but that's okay. So now I want to try. Let's try mixing a heart berry with like a spicy thing. So like, let's throw one of those in there and the bomb pepper. Is it gonna make the same thing like a mushy thing, a mushy burrito? Because if that's the case, then it'd be better to use the mushroom because mushrooms don't offer a whole lot, but they give you something. Hearty pepper wrap. 19 food. Oh, 25 max health for five minutes. Oh my gosh. So this is with the mush. This is with, oh, the mushy mushroom pepper. So this gives us an additional 25 max health for five minutes. Wow. If we had some armor, I'd say we could go face the big dude. Okay, so we got more food available. And I was kind of playing around with uh, some different recipes here. The spicy tulip salad, not great. You get four glow for two minutes, which is pretty good. We only get 10 food out of it. Um, whereas, like, you know, the mushy pepper wrap, you at least get 19 food. And food right now is actually almost honestly the issue. It's not even really the perks. It's like, I just need the most food points that I can get. So it seems like mushrooms are, like, if you can mix mushrooms with anything, you're pretty much good to go. Uh, let's do a tulip and a heart berry. I don't think it's going to be good, very, very good either. I think the glow tulips don't give you a lot of food. I mean, it's just plus one food on them, so that's kind of, uh, kind of a given, I guess. But glowing berry put oh see that doesn't seem too bad 19 food 25 max health for five minutes two and a half health every second for 20 seconds plus four glow for two minutes that's a pretty good with the glowing berry pudding that's pretty good and i like the naming scheme so if like you find something you like it's like oh this was a spicy tulip salad so it's got to be the bomb pepper and a tulip or a mushroom and a pepper or a uh to the glowing tulip and a berry you know what i mean the heart berry so I like the naming convention because then you can see like actually you know what's going on here. Uh, so let's go ahead and let's just eat that. And that is going to end our first 30 ish of Forge Keeper. So if you guys enjoyed, make sure you leave a like. If you're new here, maybe consider subscribing as well for some more. Link down below to the playable demo. And if you want to see more, make sure you comment. Comment, 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 comment down below. Let me know you want to see more. And if you want to see more, uh, maybe we'll get uh, maybe we'll get some multiplayer action going in here. Because it is multiplayer, and I do believe that you can actually play multiplayer right now, too. So that would be a lot of fun. Um, and I think Missy would actually really like this game. So um, shout out to her channel as well. If you want to see uh, Missy, the official Missy, you can have a link down below to her channel. Show us some love. But yeah, thank you again for coming out. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time.